Hi friends, welcome to KM English World. As we know that we are at the last phase of this lesson, that is paragraph paragraphs number thirteen to seventeen, which is which are on page number ten and eleven. The lesson is an encounter of a special kind. Before going to these paragraphs, let me make you the link. of what he start in the previous class that as as all of us know that when the writer took the baby lamu uh to the poultry coop laid on the floor as well as splashed some cold water and also gave him peeled banana whereas his father also gave first aid to the baby lamu it resulted into getting up setting up of the baby lamur and uh, you are also told that mother lamur was watching the total scene by sitting there and she was very happy because she found that her baby was safe and out of danger and as the writer or the narrator turned back to see the mother lamur and then he decided to make the room to have the visit or the meet of mother and her child and after that mother jumped down where this is the story where we had stopped in the previous class in the previous period now it is time to continue to paragraph number 13 and the last paragraph is 17 so we are here to continue first of all let me read these paragraphs aloud a moral reading will be there and after that let us discuss all the paragraphs line to line in english as well as to some extent in marathi for your understanding but keep in mind that my speaking in marathi cannot be useful for you for the examination point of view so try to understand in english itself okay so open the book open the course book and come on page number 10 first of all Page number ten, the last paragraph. So listen, my reading, especially concentrate upon the stress and intonations, the turns, rising and fall, as well as the pronunciations of specific words, stress marks or the stresses, wherever necessary, and also try to imitate me regarding to pronunciations. to improve your pronunciation that is more important to improve your reading skill come on immediately my father descended on the floor of the coop and picked up the baby in her arms she gave the baby a thorough body inspection to check his injuries and then cuddled him tightly in her bosom the baby found great solace in her carrying arms the mother sat still with the baby in her lap for a few minutes it was almost as if she was pondering over her options and trying to figure out how she could keep the baby safe from further assault for a few seconds the mother lamur looked straight into my eyes even today i cannot forget that look in her eyes showering silent gratitude on me for saving her child i was overwhelmed by the emotion the sentiment and the way she said thanks to me there sat a universal mother holding a stricken child in her lap then in a flash she jumped with her baby clinging to her belly and reached our kitchen floor She surveyed the area for a vicious male lamur and then leaped away 
in the direction opposite to the place of the violent encounter. The brief meeting with her mother and the baby Lamgur convinced me that in the spaces, communication and mutual, man, mutual trust is indeed a reality and should anyway strike the right chord. The relationship comes into action. The mother Lamgur showed me that food was not the only means of communication between man and animal, but there were other means of establishing a bond through trust, compassion, and mutual understanding. 55 years have passed since that day. I am now 70 years old, but I still fondly remember that encounter of a special kind, Tapan Mukherjee. This is the lesson, these are the paragraphs which I have read and now it's your turn to read all these paragraphs silently and after that, assuming that you have read all these paragraphs silently, now let me talk in detail line to line to all these paragraphs, sentence to sentence, word to word. So now it's time to discuss the lesson, the paragraphs line to line in English as well as in Marathi for your understanding. Immediately, the mother descended on the floor of the coop and picked up the baby in her arms. As we know that when baby sat up, then mother descended down. There is a word descended that is moved downwards. This is past form that is right here also. We have written past form itself. If there is descend, then that is to move, move downward. Khali uttarane. Mother descended downward, that is descended, that is jumped downward, moved downward on the floor of the coop and picked up the baby in her arms. Mother Langurne Lekhak Bazala Zhalanantar Khali jump getli ani aplya varala legez aplya bahud getla. She picked up her baby in arms. She gave the baby a thorough body inspection. Then what did Mother Langur do? She inspected whole body of her child. She gave a baby a thorough body inspection to check his injuries and then cuddled him tightly in her person. Mother Langur, first of all, she checked the whole body of baby Langur to find out whether there were injuries and how many injuries were there. And after due inspection, she hugged the baby to her bosom. Manje, tya balala, utsurun getle cha nantar, tya cha body cha tina inspection kela. Zakman sa nirikshan ke la ki kiti zakman sa halat, kote sa halat. Ani tya nantar apla bala kawet tina mithi marli, kawet jitla. The baby found great solace in her caring arms. And when the baby reached in her arms, baby felt very solace. The word solace is here. Here is solace. Before that, cuddled means held closely. Here is again keep in mind that the word it is also in the textbook, course book, it is in past tense. That is why I have also written here the meaning in past form. If there is cuddle, C U W D L E, then it will be to hold closely. Gatta pakarne. And the bosom is here that is chest. Apla chatila laune. Kaved ghene. And the baby found solace, solace means comfort and peace, shant watne, nivant watne, aram watne, baby la aicha kavet basle cha nantar 
खूप निवांत वाटलं सेफ वाटलं कम्फर्टेबल वाटलं इन हर केअरिंग आर्म्स ऑन नेक्स्ट पेज पेज नंबर इलेव्हन द मदर सॅट स्टील विथ द बेबी इन हर लॅप फॉर फ्यू मिनिट्स तिथच थोडा वेळ मदर लंगूरने आपल्या बाळाला आपल्या लॅप वरती म्हणजे मांडीवरती घेऊन बाळाला तिथंच थोडा वेळ ती थांबली सी सॅट स्टील स्टील दॅट इज क्वायट रूटेड स्तब्ध स्थिर शांत विथ अ बेबी इन हर लॅप फॉर फ्यू मिनिट्स काही क्षणासाठी इट वॉज ऑलमोस्ट ऍज इफ सी वॉज पॉन्डरिंग ओव्हर हर ऑप्शन वाय सी वॉज स्टेईंग दिअर स्टील फॉर सम मिनिट्स बिकॉज द नरेचर थॉट that she was pondering pondering means thinking or deeply ponder the word is ponder root word is ponder that is to think over deeply thinking deeply about something means may uh, mother langur was deeply thinking she was pondering about the options where to go now वेअर टू स्टॉप वेअर नॉट टू स्टॉप आता नेमकं कुठं जावं कुठं थांबावं कुठं थांबू नये याचा ती विचार करत होती वेअर हर बेबी वुड बी सेफ बेबी कुठं सुरक्षित असेल अबाउट दोज ऑप्शन सी वॉज डीपली थिंकिंग पॉन्ड्रिंग ओव्हर द ऑप्शन अँड ट्रायंग टू फिगर आउट हाऊ सी कुड कीप द बेबी सेफ फ्रॉम फर्दर असाय मदर लंगूर वॉज सिरियसली थिंकिंग सी वॉज पॉन्डरिंग अबाउट द ऑप्शन अँड ऑल्सो सी वॉज मेकिंग द फ्रेम फिगर आउट इन फ्रंट ऑफ हर आयज टू फाइंड आउट सच अ प्लेस वेअर हर बेबी वुड बी सेफ अँड ऑल्सो कॅन बी अवे फ्रॉम द फर्दर असर्ट फर्दर दॅट इज नेक्स्ट असर्ट दॅट इज अटॅक the male dominant langur should not attack again on her baby langur and that's why she thought very deeply about the options where to go and where to keep her baby safe and away from the next attack next point for a few seconds the mother langur looked straight into my eyes baga mitrano आईनं त्या बाळाला आपल्या मांडीवरती घेतलं काही मिनिट तिथं स्तब्ध राहिली विचार करत की आता बाळाला नेमकं न्यावं कुठे कुण्या ठिकाणी माझं बाळ हे या सगळ्यात पुढच्या अटॅक पासनं या पुढल्या हल्ल्यापासनं त्या मेल लंगूरच्या सुरक्षित राहील सेफ राहील याचा ती थोडा वेळ विचार करत होती ऍट द सेम टाइम द मदर लंगूर लुक स्ट्रेट इन टू माय आयज लेखक असं सांगतात नरेटर असं सांगतात की मदर लंगूर हे खूप सरळ असं सरळ लेखकाडे नजरेत नजरे नजर घालून बघत होती इव्हन टुडे अगदी आज सुद्धा आय कॅनॉट फॉरगेट दॅट लुक इन हर आय द रायटर सेज दॅट सी वॉज लुकिंग इन अ सच वे इन हर इन हिज आयज दॅट इट इज इम्पॉसिबल फॉर द रायटर टू फॉरगेट दॅट लुक of that mother langur i cannot forget that look in her eyes showering silent gratitude on me for saving her child ani mother cha te ka pahana hota lekhakakade karan she was thanking and showering silent gratitude stabdha te tun abhar manat hoti she was here is gratitude gratitude that is thank gratitude means thanks as you are showering the silent gratitudes to the narrator for thank for saving her child aplya baalala tumhi surakshit vachavlela ahe tala jivdan dilela ahe ve tyabaddal mi tumche abhar mante janu asas ti madar langur lekhakala narrator la tyacha dolyat dole galun as silently sang it hoti i was overwhelmed by the emotion te drushya khorkhoras mala bharavun denara hota 
त्या आईच्या पाहण्यानं मी अगदी भारावून गेलो होतो द सेंटिमेंट अँड द वे सी सेड थँक्स टू मी ज्या पद्धतीनं मदर लंगूनं माझे थँक्स मांडले त्या अॅनिमलनं माझे थँक्स मांडले नजरेत नजर घालून ती गोष्ट तो क्षण मी कधीच विसरू शकत नाही देर सॅच अ युनिव्हर्सल मदर होल्डिंग अ स्ट्रॅक अन चाइल्ड इन हर लॅब आणि एवढंच नाही तर मदर लंगूर जी बसली होती तिथं आपल्या बाळाला घेऊन तर ती केवळ मदर लंगूर नव्हती तर सी वॉज अ युनिव्हर्सल मदर युनिव्हर्सल इज ऑल्सो अ वर्ड हिअर हिअर इज युनिव्हर्सल दॅट इज एक्झिस्टिंग एव्हरीवेअर प्रत्येक ठिकाणी असणारी प्रत्येक आईचं जणू काय प्रत्येक मातृत्वाचं ते उदाहरण होतं की जी आई जी माता आपल्या त्रस्त असणाऱ्या बाळाला जपवून ठेवते सांभाळून ठेवते अगदी त्या त्याला कवेत घेते तसं दृश्य मला एकंदरीत दिसलं मीन्स सी वॉज रिप्रेझेंटिंग मदर लंगूर वॉज रिप्रेझेंटेटिंग टू द होल मदर्स ऑल मदर्स ऑफ द वर्ल्ड युनिव्हर्सल मदर्स नेक्स्ट वन देन इन अ फ्लॅश सी जम्प विथ हर बेबी क्लिंगिंग टू हर बेबी अँड रिस्ट अवर किचन रूम माझा आभार मानायचं झाल्यानंतर इन अ फ्लॅश सी जम्प बट टेकिंग अवे हर बेबी लंग टू द बेली क्लिंगिंग टू हर बेली बेली म्हणजे पोट आपल्या लक्षात येत आणि सी रिस्ट टू द रायटर्स हाऊस किचन रूफ लेखकाच्या घराच्या किचन रूफ वर तिथे गेली सी सर्वे द एरिया ऑफ द विसियस मेल लंगोर आणि मग वर गेल्यानंतर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सी सर्वे द होल एरिया ऑफ द विसियस लंगोर तो दुष्ट दॅट इज विकेड अशा पद्धतीचा हा लंगूर कुठे दिसतोय का त्याचा तिनं पहिल्यांदा ऑब्झर्वेशन केलं बिफोर दॅट वी हिअर रिटर्न हिअर चिकन दॅट इज टू बी हिट हार्ड क्लिंकिंग दॅट इज स्टिकिंग चिकटलेलं विकिसेस विकेट सी सर्वे द एरिया ऑफ द विसेस मेल रंगूर अँड देन लिफ्ट अवे इन द डिरेक्शन अपोजिट टू द प्लेस ऑफ द वॉयलंट एनकाउंटर आणि अशा रीतीनं तिनं जम्प मारला सी लेफ्ट इन द अपोजिट डिरेक्शन विरुद्ध दिशेने फॉर द दॅट इज विकेड अँड वॉयलंट मेल लंगूर ज्या दिशेला हा दुष्ट आणि क्रूर असा असणारा मेल लंगूर गेला होता त्याच्या विरुद्ध दिशेनं ती बाळाला घेऊन जम्प मारून निघून गेली द ब्रीफ मीटिंग विथ द मदर अँड द बेबी लंगूर कन्व्हिन्स्ड मी That interspaces communication and mutual trust is indeed reality and should anyone strike the right chord. The writer says that the brief meeting with the mother and the baby Langur convinced me. The meeting, brief meeting, short meeting with the mother and her baby. It convinced me. Tiana Malasa Lakshat Anundila ki interspaces antar prerana कम्युनिकेशन अँड म्युच्युअल ट्रस्ट इज इंडिड अगदी म्हणजे संवादामध्ये एकमेकाच्या मधला अंतप्रेरणा आणि एकमेकाच्या मधला ट्रस्ट आत्मविश्वास इज इंडिड अ रियालिटी हेच खरं सत्य आहे अँड शुड एनी वन स्ट्राईक द राईट कॉड द रिलेशनशिप हम्ड इन टू ऍक्शन आणि अशा रीतीनं मदर लंगूर आणि तिची त्याचं बाळ त्यांनी मला त्या ब्रीफ मीटिंगमध्ये ही गोष्ट लक्षात आणून दिली कि विश्वास हा खरोखरच एकमेकाचा कम्युनिकेशनचा अत्यंत महत्वाचा भाग आहे द मदर लंगूर शोड मी दॅट फूड वॉज नॉट ओनली द मीन्स ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन मदर लंगूरनं माझ्या हेही लक्षात आणून दिलं दॅट ओनली फूड इज नॉट द मीन्स ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन बिट्वीन मॅन अँड अॅनिमल बट दॅट देअर वेअर अदर मीन्स ऑफ इस्टॅब्लिशिंग अ बॉन्ड थ्रू ट्रस्ट कम्पॅशन and mutual understanding not only food but other things are equally important to have the better communication in the, in between man and animal and that is mutual understanding trust compassion that is compassion that is sympathy and kindness in between man and animal can have the that is the perfect bond in between man and animal that the the meeting short brief meeting that convinced me all these things 
55 years have passed since that day. The, we are at the last paragraph now. 55 years have passed since that day. Ya ghatnela pansawan varsha zhaleli ahe. The writer says that 55 years have passed since that day. I am now 70 years old. My age, the, right, the narrator's age today is 70 years. And the event had taken place, the event had taken place before 55 years. Means the writer the, at the time of event was only 15 years old. 15 plus 55, 70 years old today. But I still fondly, I still fondly, that is with love, I fondly remember that encounter of a special kind. But still, after 55 years of this event, I, with very love, I remember that event, that is, my action was an encounter of a special kind. That saving of a child was a special encounter that was a special kind of encounter that I had done. I cannot forget what the narrator says. Mitrano, Asha Ritina, ha lesson ye kikani finish what toy, sum toy. We have completed paragraphs 13 to 17, line to line understanding. As well, uh, and uh, tomorrow we are going to talk about these paragraphs question wise that is a1 a2 a3 a4 and a5 keeping in mind the board ssc board activity seat in view so be touching with study oh, best of luck